Audrey Cunningham went missing on Thursday, and now her father's friend will be charged with her murder. Divers found the 11-year-old's body in the Trinity River north of Houston yesterday. Don McDougall will be charged with capital murder in her death. He's already in custody on an unrelated charge and lived in a camper on the family property. Jury selection begins today in the Rust shooting trial. Weapons supervisor Hannah Gutierrez-Reed faces charges for involuntary manslaughter and tampering with evidence. Her attorneys argue she isn't to blame for the death of cinematographer Helena Hutchins, but prosecutors say she brought live ammo to the set due to negligence. Actor Alec Baldwin will face a separate trial, but no date has been set. The implications of a Supreme Court ruling in Alabama are being closely watched nationwide. The state's highest court ruled last week that frozen embryos created during fertility treatments should be considered children based on an 1872 state law. Now, advocates are issuing warnings that the ruling could have a major impact on fertility treatments in the state. Another $1.2 billion in student loan debt wiped out by the Biden administration. Loans will be canceled for more than 150,000 borrowers who have been making payments for at least 10 years. So far, Biden has approved nearly $138 billion in debt cancellation for almost 3.9 million borrowers.